Welcome to the National Exotics YouTube channel. This channel is all about showing the rescue work that we do, how we're going to be collaborating with different services, different sanctuaries, emergency services across the coming years to showcase our growth and talk about any topical events that are going on, as well as hopefully collaborating with some interesting YouTubers. But today what we're doing is talking about something that's very special to me, and that's these guys, turtles. Now it's estimated that there's approximately 400,000 turtles and tortoises that are pets within the, across the UK. So obviously they're, they're an extremely popular pet, but what we're talking about today is why they're on the invasive species list, specifically some of the more common, formerly common species like your, your sliders and that kind of thing. Now one of the reasons that these guys are on the invasive species list is because the amount of illegal releases that have happened over the last few years. So in 2019, these guys were added to the alien invasive species list. I'm going to put these down because they're not going to sit still. Um, so yeah, the, the one of the more common releases, I would say, um, and having a sanctuary myself, I see firsthand just how many rehomes are needed. Within the last month alone, I would say I've taken in about 15 turtles um, that will live with me for the rest of their lives. So, you know, I think it's important to understand that while this doesn't represent everyone that owns these animals, you know, there's a lot of responsible keepers out there who are doing things the right way. Um, there's also a lot of misinformation that's given when people are getting these animals by various pet shops or breeders who aren't being responsible. And they're not properly explaining the amount of work that these guys can actually be. They take a lot of work and um, they need regular water changes otherwise they will start to smell they have complex lighting and dietary needs um, and they also live a really long time which i'm sure isn't a surprise for anyone watching so what reason why turtles being released is such a problem is because they can actually live in this country quite well so when it gets colder they go into a state of what's called brumation where their bodies slow down and they can live quite happily in our climates at the bottom of our waterways. Now these guys being in our waterways causes a lot of different problems from water quality in smaller um, bodies of water to eating our native plants or our native animals and just generally causing quite a lot of havoc. Now there is an argument that all animals are born free and why shouldn't they be allowed to live in our, eco in our ecosystems? And I think what's really important to understand is that while these guys may seem harmless, they can cause a lot of harm and they can cause massive problems for our native species. If you take the grey squirrel, for example, the red squirrel population has fallen from approximately 3.5 million. So this really demonstrates why it's important for non-native species not to be introduced into our environments. Now, I want to stress again that there's been a lot of negative press recently about exotic pet owners in general and while this video is talking about how people can be irresponsible and there is misinformation when getting these animals when they're very small and cute the, this does not represent the majority of pet owners in general and when people say that these kind of animals shouldn't be being kept my argument would be the people that are keeping these animals wrong shouldn't be allowed animals in general it's not specific to exotic animals. And one of the major issues in this country that we face is the amount of cats and dogs that are constantly needing home and the damage that they can cause. You think about the amount of rodents and birds that cats kill on a regular basis. So for any of you guys that don't know who we are and you've just stumbled across this video, we're the nation's only limited company that deals with exotic animals, whether that's escapes, rehomes, um, illegal releases. We're the only organisation within the UK that's actively doing something to try and improve this situation and get these animals into suitable homes where they can live happy lives and not cause damage to any of our native species. So one of the reasons about making this video is to try and inform people who maybe are thinking of getting a turtle uh, to the work that goes into keeping these for a long period of time. Or maybe for someone who's thinking that maybe after getting a turtle, it's not for them for whatever reason, and they're wondering what to do next. So we've discussed the problems with releasing these guys into our waterways. So now I want to talk a little bit about what we can do. 
We can offer a rehoming service, so we can find suitable homes. We work with sanctuaries all over the country, part of a very knowledgeable network of people who can provide these guys with proper homes. Uh, these guys are knowledgeable and they will be safe and live the remainder of their lives in the care of some of the country's leading experts on turtles. So if you're thinking that maybe turtles aren't for you and you have one, feel free to give us a message on our Facebook page, which will be linked down in the description below, and we can try and find someone who's close to you who will be able to take your animal off you and offer it a proper home. Background's falling, beh falling down behind me. Okay, so that's going to be it for this video today. There's going to be a video for, it's going to be about once a week whilst we get going. We've got lots of really interesting things planned. We're collaborating with some amazing YouTubers and capturing some of the things we do. Lots of exciting things coming up. So make sure you're subscribing to the channel, hitting the like button and sharing with anyone who you think this could be interested in. Thanks for watching. I've been Joe and I'll see you next time.